hello everyone welcome to the channel again in this video we are going to learn how you can add the google recapture verification checkbox into your laravel uh, application so here you can see in my visual studio code i have a laravel application with the name recapture app so this this is the application that i'm going to use and in in, in this application i will implement the uh, recapture verification and this application is also running in my google browser locally so here you can see this is a very simple application in which in which i have implemented the registration system and the login system with the help of laravel breeze authentication system and if you want to add the similar kind of uh, authentication system then you can watch my previous video from the laravel playlist uh, so uh, the package that I'm going to use in this video to uh, to implement the recap Google recapture into this application is the no capture package and I will also uh, mention the link of this package into my uh, description of this video so first of all let's install this package into our uh, application so let's install this package with this command that is composer require and this package name so let's copy this command from here and go to the uh, uh, code editor and open a new terminal and let's paste it in here and this will install the uh, no capture package into our laravel application now we have installed the this package into our application now let's set up this package so the first thing you need to do is just copy this uh, class and go to the uh, code editor and then go to the config folder and then app.php file now in here you have to paste this class in the providers so let's paste this into the providers array now the second thing you need to uh, copy this alias link of this package and then go to the aliases array and then paste it in here and then save this file now the third step you need is to run this vendor publish command to publish the uh, vendor files of this package so let's uh, open a new terminal and uh, paste this command here and here you can see public publishing complete now we have successfully set up this uh, 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 no capture package into our application now let's uh, configure the secret key and the side key uh, of Google recapture so let's copy this from here and let's go to the dot env file of your laravel project and uh, in this dot uh, env file you have to paste this secret key and the side key of Google recapture now uh, to generate the side key and the secret key of Google recapture you can see it is also mentioned here you can obtain them from here so let's open this link in a new tab now uh, with the help of this form we can generate the secret key and the side key of google recapture so uh, if you are if your application is running on a live server then uh, you have to give the domain name here but we are but our application is running locally into our machine so let's give localhost here and then you can also select the recapture version 3 but i'm going to select recapture version 2 because i'm going to use the om i'm not a robot checkbox verification so let's select this recapture version 2 and then i'm not a robot checkbox then uh, in the domain option uh, as i said if your application is on a live server you have to add the domain name of your website but uh, our application is running on a on a local host server so the first domain we need to add is 127.0.0.1 this is because our local server is 127.0.1 now uh, the second domain is the local host because we our application is running into local host now accept the uh, recapture terms and service and it is up to you to check this send alerts to owners now uh, click this submit button and here you can see localhost has been registered and we get the side key and the secret key of our google recapture so let's copy this side key from here 
and again go to the uh, env file and in the side key let's paste it in here now again go to the uh, google recapture form and copy this secret key now let's go to the dot uh, env again and replace this secret key and save this dot env file now we have successfully uh, configured the secret key and the side key of google recapture into our application now let's use this google recapture into the uh, login form also in the registration form so to use this you can use these two option uh, so i'm going to use this default option so let's copy this from here and let's open your uh, login uh, uh, blade file in my case i have my uh, login.blade.php file in the auth uh, folder because i'm going i'm using praise authentication system now in this file uh, under the form under the login form uh, i'm i'm going to use the uh, recapture so uh, just below the remember me button let's add a new dev with a class of margin 4 and in here let's paste this no captcha render js function now uh, the second thing we need to paste is the uh, no captcha display function so let's copy this from here and let's paste it in here now let's save this login plate file and now let's refresh this login page and here you can see we uh, we got the uh, I'm not a robot checkbox here now uh, let's go to the registration page and let's also add the uh, this uh, recapture here so let's copy this div from here and let's open the register uh, blade file and under this password uh, dev let's paste in here now let's refresh this registration page and here you can see we got uh, the recapture verification checkbox in our registration page also and also in the login uh, login page now let's see if it is working or not so if i register a fake user in my registration uh, page and if i didn't check this i'm not a robot here and click this register button then here you can see the user has been registered successfully uh, this is because i didn't add the uh, uh, recapture validation into the uh, controller so let's open the registration controller in my case i have register user controller and in this in this validation validate function uh, you need to add the validation of google recapture so you can find the validation in the uh, documentation of this package here you can see under the validation heading uh, so let's copy this uh, so let's copy this line and let's go to the validation and let's paste it in here and let's save it now if i register a user uh, let's refresh and let's register a fake user and if i do not check this i'm not a robot checkbox and click this register button i will get an error because i didn't uh, check this i'm not a robot checkbox so uh, this is completely working now I got this error uh, the G recapture response field is required so this is not a good uh, validation error so how you can customize it uh, here you can see under the custom validation message you have this custom validation guide so uh, you, what you need to do you just need to go to the uh, uh, controller register controller and let's add a new array and let's add a new array here and uh, let's copy this g, g recapture response and in the second array paste this thing and dot required so if this recapture uh, is required if we got this error so we need a custom message so let's provide a custom message please check are you 
a robot or not let's save this and again go to the registration form now let's register a fake user and let's register and here you can see we got a different message please check are you a robot or not and now if I check and if I register a user uh, by clicking this I'm not a robot checkbox and click register then here you can see the user has been registered successfully so here you can see we have successfully implemented the Google reCAPTCHA validation into our uh, form so I hope that this video will help you to implement or add Google reCAPTCHA verification into your Laravel application and if you have any queries or any question related to this uh, just mention your problems or question into the comment box below